Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in a mod I have never played before on this channel. So here we are. So, as you can tell from the thumbnail, we're playing as a certain someone, a certain nation, led by a certain someone. But, as per normal game rules, uh, I'm just going to let everything be pretty nor normal and random. But I will leave on historical AI for this campaign just because I have never played this mod before, Red Flood. So, I think we're in for an interesting time from what I've heard. <clears throat> Regardless, uh, it's been a while since I've actually been able to play Red Flood, for, at least for my own personal account, just because for a very long time Red Flood was not working because of the launcher. Regardless, a couple mods that we're using is obviously Red Flood, Player Light Peace Conferences, uh, Colored Buttons, Colored Events, and State Trester Tool Mod, which doesn't look like it's working, but it still might work. Cool. Uh, thank you to all the developers. Welcome to Red Flood. If you want to read this, go right ahead. What if no one won World War I? Thank you, and no thank you, kind player. Have some fun. Cool. All right, we got a couple divisions here. Let's go. The, the reason I chose Germany for my first campaign in Red Flood is just because... Mostly because we get two, like, research slots early on. But let's go ahead and do the 1936 Reich, Reichsräte Congress. The Reichsräte Congress is the most important political power in Germany, consisting of representatives from all of Germany. This entity can propose and deny laws and elect and disband both the Zentralrat as well as the Rat der Volkskommissare. Cool. 100 political power? Great. Uh, let's see. We want to do this. We want to do that like normal. Now, we do have a lot of these Volkschutzen Division, which is okay. But we want to use not maybe the Rote Guard. The Rote Guard looks pretty good. That's actually probably a better division to use. Uh, let's go with 12 early on. Uh, Proletarische Hundertschaft. That might be good for garrisons, this one. This is better for garrisons. Uh, yeah, bye-bye. Cool. Uh, do we want anything of Panzer Divisions? Yes, we do, but that does not look very good. I don't want to make garbage divisions yet. That's okay. Marines are looking... Oh, hold on. One, two, three, plus four. Okay, that's a little different. Whatever. And let's grab some technology. Normal, normal, normal stuff. Cool, and... Hmm... Wow, we really don't have a navy. And I know Germany normally doesn't have a navy. What about planes? We're doing okay on planes. We could use tactical bombers. We're probably going to stay with close air support and fighters. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to need a navy. What we're going to do in this campaign, we're definitely going to need a navy. Mm, so, like I said before, I have no idea how this mod is going to run. Or, you know, what's going to happen. So maybe give me a few spoilers here in the comments. Just in case, so I can keep an eye on what is... What could happen, or what will most likely happen, since we are we are on historical. Get some guns, get some sport equipment, get some motorized, get some artillery. I almost never choose anti-air or anti-tank for a single player. Not really a point to. Uh, ocelot's good. Fighters, yes. That's air support, yes. Into our bombers, we could use those, but I'm not going to do that in this campaign. Go ahead and give us a ton of guns. Put three on there. Put five on there. Put four, five, five. And more guns. Cool. Ship-wise. Oh my goodness. If I see level 1, I'm not using them. I, If I can avoid it, I never use level 1 stuff. Even level 2 destroyers. Uh, I really don't like to... I don't care for destroyers that much. Black cruisers in general are just a little better. You know what? Let's use destroyers. I will use destroyers in this campaign. I almost never use them. Let's use them this time. For now... Uh, I really don't want to use anything until I can upgrade stuff. I really don't want to make any of this stuff until I can upgrade this. Mm, that's not... Terrible. It's not bad. And I'm so used to seeing that, so that's better. Yeah, I don't want to make anything that's not going to be good. So, let's do that. And I guess we're almost ready to let time go on. Uh, cavalry. I love cavalry, but go ahead and go into this. Rope the guard. A couple of these guys. Pull you out. And then pull you out as well, because you're going to be special. Just like the rest of us. Do that. Hello. For now, I'm just gonna make uh, five army groups for now. Oh, before we do that, since we're here, let's put you in half again. Boom, there you go. You two, link up before I forget. You come here, you be led by this dude, and then you guys only eight subs. That's so sad. Go ahead and train for now. We're gonna use up all the fuel that we have since we probably won't get into any sort of conflict right now. So. Alright, now we can let time go on. Cool, so this will be led by a group person. Hmm. 
mainly infantry. Ooh, Levi's decision. The Ray Paul Levy, or Levi, chairman of the Council of People's Commissars, has announced that he will not run as a candidate for the next election. This announcement has shook up the political landscape of Germany. Not only is Levi, or Levy, a beloved public figure, but without him, the KPD has a chance to lose the next election. The Politburo has already announced that a new candidate has been chosen, but an NMAPD, or USPD, government doesn't seem far away anymore. Thank you for everything, comrade. Cool. And for infantry, I really think attack is probably the best. Recovery rate. Hmm. Well, max general army. Let's do Ludwig, just because he already has expert delegator. Ooh, he's aggressive assaulter. I love that. And for this guy, we'll put him on max. The tankies. Uh, <clears throat> Monstron looks like the best. Uh, you guy, or you, just you. Get some more recon. There you go. Seems like we're running out of people to use here. There's a lot of tank generals. Siegfried? Ooh, mending the schism. After the retirement of Le Levi, the Politburo has decided to choose Ernst Meyer as a new candidate for the position of chairman of the Council of People's Commissaries. While he has a very impressive biography and great knowledge in all matters of politics, he lacks charisma and warmth. Thus, the vanguardist wing of the KPD decided to propose their own candidate, the Russian immigrant Lev Sidov. To stabilize the party, a proposal was made by a number of influential communists to choose a new candidate to reunite the party. Uh, I really have no idea what this does, so... They should not interfere into matters of the party. The decision of the Politburo stands. Hmm. I want to go with this one just because it gives you 10 political power. I don't know this is going to hurt us. I've heard of Bertolt Brush before. Actually, I've read some of his uh, works before as well. He is, a, he is a poet, yeah. He was an interesting fellow in real life. So I'm going to go with this. Don't, don't interfere. Very interesting fellow. Bertolt Brecht. Uh, Bertolt. Uh, I'm going to do that. We might need more generals. All these people are so good at tanks. A former Imperial. That sounds actually like a lot of fun. But you do have offensive doctrine. Mm, I don't want to use these guys. Uh. But if that's all we have. If, we'll use them, I guess. I guess everyone wants tanks. And we will be focusing heavily on tanks in this campaign, obviously. So. And there's also Prussia here, but we got to take them out eventually. Oh, Kurt. Junkerstadt. Disloyal proletariat. Power of the Freikorps. Bloody January. Ooh, that's not good for them. So, the Reichsrata Congress. Today, comrades from all over Germany have gathered in the Prussian House of Representatives in Berlin. Many important matters of economy, politics, and military were discussed, but on the fifth and last day of the Congress, the most important decisions of all was made who would lead Germany into the future. All parties had good speakers. The KPD spoke of revolution and progress, the USPD of peace and freedom, and the NMAPD of unity and strength. But after everything decided, they chose... Hmm. So, because we want to go down a certain path, and definitely go down this way, we need the NMAPD, the true defender of Germany. Oh, and 27 naval XP, not bad. Cool. Uh, we probably need more repairs. Go ahead and do that for now. Actually... Before we make a decision about who we're going to use, okay. Uh, battleship, uh, uh, World War One ship. Oh no, no, no! It's a normal battleship. Another fast battleship. Oh <clears throat> no, 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 no! But you know what? We already have level four anti-air, which is honestly insane. I don't know why we already have that, but I'm not really going to complain about that. So we have that fast battleship. We could do carrier armor, but. Yeah, I'm not going to lower my armor that much. Do that. Do that. Looking better already. We have no radar, which is fine for now. Beautiful. Now that's going to be a nice battleship. That's actually really kind of nice. Do that. We have five more. Um, we could make some light cruisers next. Or destroyers. Destroyers are pretty easy to make. But, um, we'll see. I'll make a mix of light cruisers and destroyers in this campaign. If we can. Manpower, not, look, not looking great, but not too bad. So we did Congress. We could do the victory against Karl Otto Patel. That looks okay. Uh, spread the revolution looks nice. Propaganda looks very good. I love these 35-day focuses. I love them so much. Over here, gain some stability. A socialist market. Hmm. I want to come over here so we can grab another research slot. So, Deutsche Gesellschaft zur Forderung der Wissenschaft. So, the DGFW formerly known as the Kaiser Wilhelm Gesellschaft, has the goal to further research and scientific development. Scientific or scientific. By endorsing the society, we are able to promote it as a piece of revolutionary science. Good. Science, science, science. 
Recall unpopular representatives. We get more weekly stability. Um, seven days divided by 18, so that's 20. We actually probably get a lot of stability by doing that. Partial mobilization that might be really good. Do we have anything unique here? Not really. That's a little disappointing. That's okay, though. Let's go ahead and do this first. And then we'll do the recall unpopular representatives just to see what happens. Just to see. Ah, Goebbels announces his victory. In an ever grandiose and theatrical speech to the German masses, Goebbels took to the stage in his unique fashion and spoke of his new vision for Germany. <clears throat> Comrades, how long has it been since we first broke off the chains of capitalist oppression? It has been decades, has it not? And yet, what has occurred alone despite a miraculous revolution? What has occurred has been a travesty, comrades. The job was left half finished. Across the continent, our comrades were butchered by depraved acts of white terror. <clears throat> the degenerate French ran our good comrades out of the nation, and now they sit eagerly on our borders, looking to impose their proto-reactionary agenda on us. The British impose the same dictatorial bourgeois hegemony as they always have, keeping down the flames of proletariat or revolution. All of this has occurred to the detriment of the good German nation and its socialist people. No more will this travesty be allowed to occur. The revisionism has come to an end. In its place arises the true vanguard of the German workers. The National Majority Workers' Party of Germany is here and it will stay here. As a protectorate of the workers and as a protectorate of Germany against the anti-red reptiles that plague the earth, the age of half-measured socialism is over. In its place, a new socialism takes root. One that will go all the way to free every man, woman, and child from the yoke of bourgeois hegemony. The plundering of our people is at an end. Now is the time for our red retribution. And we shall make no apologies for our rightful revenge. A new dawn of socialism has begun, dear comrades. Very good. Very good, my friends. Oh, I completely forgot about the air situation. We have no plans in the air. Okay. That means we can start from scratch. Ooh. Socialists take Madagascar. The fires of the revolution burn ever brighter and higher. Yeah. Totally understand this mod. Totally. I should really actually look into the lore of this. But I really... Okay, so the reason I chose this campaign uh, for Red Flood... <clears throat> first of all, I like the research bonus you get as Germany. And you also get Goebbels, just because... He's just so happy when you see him. He's just so happy. I don't think I've ever seen him really that happy before. And I want to make as many people as happy as possible. That's what I'm going to say. Yeah, we'll put it like that. Uh, I assume we're going to go to war with Poland eventually, so that's why we're doing that. Tanks come over here. Maybe. Oh, wait, hold on. Does the UK actually... Oh, they own Calais. Austin Chamberlain, you look very serious. Ah, very good, very good. Volkswagen. Rot front, which is actually probably, I think, a good thing to do. We need to do this. We need Volkswagen to do that, though. But let's do experimental science. Germany is a country of thinkers. The thinkers, or the country of Eps of Einstein, Planck, and Meitner. We are destined to go into unknown territories and find out the things our ancestors needed goods to explain. Or needed gods to explain. Yeah, gods, not goods. Maybe goods. Goods and gods. And we are the leader of the Third International. Which is kind of cool. Very kind of cool. And I do have a cup of nice red coffee here. Hmm. Ah, very nice, very nice, very nice. So, Italy. Italy is led by Ivano Bonomi. They have a unique focus tree. This is very unique. They have... Oh, civil war breaks out in the east. Ooh, Japan. Could we influence the Japanese government? It looks like so. We can send a total of two divisions. And we have no fuel for that. Hmm. Well, let's see what we can do. Uh, who is this? Monstein? Yeah, come over here for now. Send volunteers. Cool. How many planes can I send you guys? A total of 88, which is not much. Go ahead and stop training so we need to save on fuel. I will... I don't know if they have fighters. I'm going to go ahead and maybe send... Send you guys. There we go. Just in case. Cool. And my ships for now go ahead and stop training since we need to save a little bit on fuel. Cool. Alright, and go go ahead and just buy one more thing of fuel from hmm. Well Madagascar said this day they were going to turn to socialist, but you know what, Venezuela's fine for now. Yeah, we're still not getting any sort of Okay, so we're now getting fuel because we had to we had to let our ships go home. Uh, China looks like it's had, had some issues, okay. And Russia's really broken up, which I love. The Beijing Compromise? Oh. 
Do you guys have a unique focus tree? No, you don't. Bye, Ying. It's been a while since I've ever played as the China. I'll go back and play as China someday again. Alright, how is the air power here, then? Not terrible. Home Islands? Uh oh The Reich has declared war on Austrian revolt. Um... Libertarian Marxists versus Depostic. Despotic. Huh. I don't know if these guys are going to actually win. I don't know if I should really send guys over. They don't really like us either, so... Um... They don't even have planes. Yeah, I don't know about this. I don't know about helping them. I don't know about the Japanese. Nice. Led by Tailman. <clears throat> I know he was a real life figure. That guy was. Cool. And upgrades. <clears throat> uh, von Manstein. Yes. <clears throat> cool. Oh, nice. Let's go and try this. I've never done this. So we have now 56. Uh-oh. Wait, Austria. Oh, we can actually invite... Mm. Is that a good thing? Uh, I'm not sure that's a good thing or not. I want to help out the Japanese, but... Experimental science. Cool. I was going to do N map D victory. We have won the elections. Ah, yes. Another research slot. Well, I wanted to help out the Japanese, but, uh... Oh, well. Wait, Brazil? Wants our help in their war efforts. Okay. Cool. I don't think I get to, get to war this quickly, but okay. Cuba, okay. L Luxembourg, um, Luxembourg. Okay, well, okay, sure. Just go through the mountains if you can. Cut these guys off. And I'll take one of you guys. Do that. Thank you. That's weird seeing Switzerland not as a red country. That's it's very weird. And I'm going to take you guys. Oh, yes. <clears throat> Excuse the cracks of my voice. Hmm. Come on. Ah, Hungry's over here too. Good. Alright, so is Austria really strong or something? I don't know why they're beating us back at all. Hmm. I mean, it is mountains, so. We've lost 5,000, I've lost 9,000. Okay, cool. I'd recommend maybe one division going down through here, maybe. Cut these guys off in the back. Great War Heavy Hole, good. I can't imagine Austria keeping this up for much longer. They don't really have that much manpower. And our... Are our planes doing anything here? Like, we need a couple more, maybe. Oh, you guys are here, which is nice. Famine in this area, cool. Very cool. Ah, victory, good. We could go this way, but newer Deutsche Sozialismus, cool. Circle power, cool. Oh, that's not bad. Get even more stuff, so, more stuff like that. Um, anything over here? Rot uh, Vox Marina. This is okay over here. Hmm. Now let's go back over here and do this one. Neuer Deutscher Sozialismus. Since we are in power now, we should start to model the state into our vision: a strong state consisting dedicated and patriotic citizens. All working as one family. And the head of said family is Goebbels, the leader of the people. Yes. Nothing could ever go wrong. 
What is this? Oh, this stuff. Um, ah, daily political power? Uh, it's only 62, sure, why not? I'm gonna have to concentrate you guys, like, right here or something. I'm happy you guys just go this way. We can circle these guys and kill them, please. Good, we're getting to Vienna. This is that's actually causes quite a few casualties. I don't like this. Really don't. Alright, begin attacking. Good, kill them off. Now oh, they're Jaegers, of course, they would be mounting soldiers. Construction one, very good. Uh your gain. Let's go and grab one of those. And plane wise, we're doing pretty well with this stuff. Oh. Good. Yeah, actually, how many divisions does Austria have? That's a ton of divisions. Austria normally doesn't have that many divisions, which is a little surprising to see. Cool. Let's go ahead and calm things down a little bit. Uh, what the heck? I thought we already got all this stuff. Keep them in place. off. Good. Now, if you can't win, that's pretty pathetic. That's in... Yeah, these are thick enemy divisions or something. That doesn't make any sense. Man, we need more guns and everything. Oof. Yeah, we're, we're really out. This is not good. I was not expecting such a struggle this early on. I'll push him back over the line, over the river. Cool. Let's go ahead and grab the Geheime Volkspolizei. The enemies of the revolution are hiding everywhere, even among those who call themselves communists. To combat the counter-revolution and preserve Germany, we must create a force that can prosecute the enemies and traitors without being held back by laws. Come on, guys. You guys can do this. I know you can. Can they pierce her armor? They probably can. Huh. Yep. Hey, look. You're in trickle. Good. Die. Still building. Still building. Only 35% stability. Ah, good. That group died. That's good. Good, 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 good. Hold. You're gonna have to hold the entire time, guys. Sorry, but it's gonna have to happen. Go move in. Come on down here. Go that way. Come here. We're gonna try and circle these guys right here. Good. Now let's kill these guys. Good. Oh wow, these guys are suffering quite a bit. Get in there. Retreat. I don't want you to die. But he might die. Okay, he didn't die. Good. Well, at least we got quite a bit of army XP. We've taken a lot of losses. I was not ready for this war. Whew. If that's the case, hmm. I really don't want to use tanks in the mountains. I really don't. Breakthrough Salzburg, good. Alexander Kolchak assassinated. Okay. And reintroduce executions. The councilists are quick in declaring the abolition of the death sentence one of the greatest achievements of the revolution, not realizing that they have disarmed the proletariat. What a shame. Central Congress Committee, more weekly stability. It's not bad. Malaga SC entry into the international. Madagascar wishes to join the international, seeking an ambassador to Germany, claiming it is the new home for the socialist movement. What shall we do? Of course. I love allies. Parade. Weekly war support. That's not bad. Cool. Let our guys move around first. Get over here. Well, this sucks. This really sucks. Well, let's try our best. Cool. I'm just going to have you guys, like, just follow your way down here. Uh, no. Oh, my God. Come on. Go that way. 
Good. Get all these guys off. You can force attack it a little bit more. Uh, Max, do you have any upgrades? No, that's okay. Ludwig. That's better. Good. Cool. Open party membership. I kind of like that. Radio, good. Of course, they have so many divisions just stacked here. God, I hate the Austrians. Why are they so strong? Usually, Austrians are not weak, but they're not that strong. Oh, cool. Um, you know what? Go ahead. Everyone go in. Move in. Just go wherever you can. I'm going to come over here. Good. This part of Austria is bad. Okay, they just left Vienna. Okay. <clears throat> okay, sure. Why not? They just... My bad, guys. My bad. I I was not ready for that. I was not ready for that at all. I'll give this all to them. Even though I would love to take this. We'll give it to them. Do they have their own book history? Hopefully they do. No. Well, they have their own. They don't have a unique one. 84% stability. That wasn't bad. Recalling people was not a bad thing to do for us. I would like even a little bit more stability, maybe. Let's do that one. Cool. Yeah, that took way too long. My apologies, everyone. Let's go ahead and do... I'm going to get down here it's faster, faster, faster. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, limited. Limit. Council power. While the councils are hailed as the greatest achievement of the revolution, the quarrels and divisions weaken Germany. We should give more power to the party so we can be more decisive. Good, good, good. Now we have to recover from that bloody war. Jesus Christ, that was probably too much. Ugandan commune. Um, I did not take a look at this yet. Holy cow. New Belgium. Prussian Congo. This is a mess. And I know these guys had a focus tree. They still do, which is kind of cool. New Belgium. Uh, a couple African states. Yeah, this is interesting to say the least. Uh, I can't even send volunteers. Cool, mechanical computing. Love me some radar. How's Japan doing? They're, they're still fighting. They are still fighting. Oh, I can't send... We need, oh, did I lose division? I must have lost divisions or something. We don't have 30. Wow. That's not good. We're going to pop these guys out. All right, I was wondering when they were going <clears> to... <throat> Come here, excuse me. Excuse me. Cool. I must have lost a few divisions. Wow, that's really bad of me. Okay, two more divisions. Good. Uh, do I really want to say tanks? They're really incredibly weak right now. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Infantry equipment. Mm. Well, we could just use guys to help hold the line. Hey, but you know what? We do have... 53... Army XP, so that's not too bad. No, give and take. How many planes can I send now? 98. That's actually not too bad. We're gonna hold. I'm just gonna do this. There you go. There you go. There you go. Cool. Yeah, it looks like these guys are gonna beat him back. This would be a great opportunity for us to get a, quite a bit more army XP. If that's the case, open party membership, daily vanguard social support. I want more weak war support. I think that'd be really helpful. Let's grab that real quick. Because everything down here seems okay. We don't even have a theorist. Chief of the Air Force, military. We have no one for military staff. Hmm. No matter, we shall still do a, oh, an okay job. And Spain is killing itself. Oh my goodness. Do we really want to help them? It might be worth it. Accelerationists? Hmm. Sounds like a fun ideology. I could send volunteers. Um, I guess I'll send volunteers. Why not? Get the army XP, naval XP, not naval XP, air XP. And how many planes can I send you? 99. So that's not too bad. Do we have any extra spare planes, actually? Not really too much. Alright, cool. Cool, limited council power. And we could do that. 
we'll do that. I mean, we could go that way. Let's go ahead and keep going some other direction. Uh, war support, war support, stability. Ooh, central plant economy. That's kind of cool. Conversion speeds, okay. Construction speed for military factories. Um, hmm. Max factories in a state. Construction speed. Ban unions. Remove Prussian perfectionism. Uh, that's okay. Okay. Not bad. Not bad, not bad. Uh, I'm gonna do Rote Front. Or Volkswehr. So we can go down to this one. Not Rote Front. Not yet. The Volkswehr is a shield that keeps Germany peoples safe from imperialism and reactionary revanchism. If we let our guard down, we will be mauled by one of the many enemies of socialism. Ah, good. Let's help these guys out first. We're gonna just plop them someplace. Help them defend some, air some territory. Uh, let's move up north so we can free these divisions over here. And you should be led by... Uh, it doesn't really matter. Um, yeah. He's an infantry guy, so go and do that. Uh, do you not have... Oh, there you go. There you go. Green air is always nice to have, right? Always nice. Alright, guys are down here too. That's cool. That's good. That's very, very good. Since we're here. And we saw how hard we were hit. Using our marines. Let's do this. Make them at least 20 combat with for now. That'd be nice. You guys get engineers already. Give them some... Armored recon? Let's do that one. That sounds like fun. Cool. Everyone else is going to train if you need to. You guys be high on the list for goods and stuff like that. At least we got Austria here. It's kind of nice. Hey, that showed up too as well. Very good. Now, I don't think we'd be able to do that much since we took such a massive hit to everything earlier in the war against those evil Austrians. So what we're going to do is come over here first. La Coruña. And I'm going to come over here as well. Oh, you guys did a great job already. Nice. Cool. Can we help out? Maybe? Yes. 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 These aren't even the greatest divisions that we have. Oh, we have a good amount of motorized. We need a lot more artillery, a lot more infantry, a lot more tanks. Jesus. Um, can't do war economy, which kind of sucks. That's okay. Uh, it's 1936. It's about to be 1937. We probably want to get industry stuff. Probably. You guys are up here, which is nice. We're going to help out. Let's get to La Coruña. You guys should be able to do that pretty easily. Nice. Come on. Spain. Uh, okay. He went to war with Morocco as well. American Party wins American general election. Well, is that like the America... Like a like an America First Party, or is it just like a generic America Party? Because if America doesn't win American elections, is it really American? Hmm. Big question to ask here. Cool. About over there. And, oh man, they are flooding through there. That's not good. Go ahead and help out of here. Delete those guys. Yes, yes. Volkswehr. Beautiful. And now let us grab... Rota... Luftwaffe now. Create the ZKBMT. So the Central Construction Bureau for Military Technology oversees the development of the new designs for weapons and military vehicles. This will make our research more effective. Cool. But fortunately, that's going to end probably our time together here for right now. This has definitely turned into an interesting first episode, even though I struggled greatly with Austria. No, Japan was annexed. We were focused on the other area too much. No, we lost Japan. Oh, well, let's not lose in Spain then. But yeah, I took a very long time. Not expecting how difficult it would be to take out Austria. We lost Japan, but we're helping out in Spain, like I said earlier. And so, if you enjoyed today's episode, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I will see you all tomorrow as we will have a good time with our happy, smiling leader, Goebbels. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.